Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lizelle and today I'm going to be filming a different video for you guys. Um, I'm going to be filming my favorites for the month of March and I'm also going to include uh, all my empties. I only have a few empties so that's why I'm going to just throw it into this video. So starting off with skincare, I've been really loving this Sephora brand concealer. It is just um, the green one, it's the Bright Future one and it's supposed to reduce redness. Um, I bought this because I wanted to conceal the blemishes I had on my face, like all the red ones. So um, I bought this to help counteract that and I'm loving it this month because it's been um, keeping my skin really even in complexion. and. The foundation lays on top of this product really nicely, so it's a 10 in my book. My next favorite for the month of March is this Duo Adhesive Eyelash Glue. It is the clear to white one. So um, if you watch my videos, you probably know that I use the Black Tone Duo Eyelash Glue. So when I was using the black one, I always had to put on eyeliner, like a thin strip of eyeliner before I put on my eyelashes and with this I don't have to because I'm really digging the look without any like lashes without any eyeliner so that's why I got this and that's why I've been loving it this month. My next favorite is a blush and uh, this is a NARS blush and this is in the shade Deep Throat. Yes, it's in the shade Deep Throat and this is like a peachy kind of gold shimmery blush. And I really love this because it just gives my cheeks that flush of color to make me look alive. So my next favorite is the Anastasia Glow Kit and this is the That Glow Kit. And this one is all the champagne bronzy colors. I really like this one because it suits my skin tone a lot better and it just gives me a bronzy glow. I don't know, but I like to mix all of the shades together and make my own shade, I guess. And then it just gives me a really nice luminous glow from within and I look like I'm radiating sunlight. I don't know. Anyway, yeah, that's that that glow kit. I've been really loving this this month. It's a great product. 10 out of 10 would recommend. My favorite eyeshadow palette this month was the Morphe 35K palette. It's the coffee palette with um, all the brown shades. I've been really loving this for neutral looks for every day and it's just a, the perfect versatile palette. It has a lot of matte shades, a lot of shimmer and satin shades that you can use for whatever look. So I was really loving this this month. It's great. 10 out of 10. Would recommend. Go ahead. So for skincare, I have one skincare product that I'm going to mention in this video and it is the Mario Badescu drying lotion and um, at night after I wash my face tone and moisturize I just put this on any blemishes that I have so that in the morning when I wake up it is completely gone I love this product 10 out of 10 would recommend you can find this um, online you can find it at Ulta and I believe it was like 17 18 dollars um, yeah it really works. This is a one touch pump and what I use this for, I use this for um, toner. I just put my toner on the inside and I put my toner on the inside and then I just take a cotton pad and then I'll take the cotton pad and pump this down and then the product comes up and then I can use it without, I don't know. But I got this from a Japanese kind of dollar store called Daiso in my area. Um, I got this for $1.50 and I got two. I'm using the other one right now. That's why there's nothing in here. 10 out of 10 would recommend. Another favorite I have for the month of March are these Ray-Bans that I purchased recently. These are the Aviator 62 millimeters, and these are just the, um, I think these are the green black ones, I don't remember. But they just look like this and I picked these because they fit my face really well opposed to the other one so that's why I got these and I was I've been in the market for a good pair of sunglasses so that's why I picked these up the last favorite I have for the month of March is actually an app maybe two apps um, they're games 
and I play these while I'm waiting for someone or something. I don't know. Um, but the first one is Tetris. Yeah, I just play Tetris whenever I'm bored or whenever I'm waiting for someone. And then the second app is Color Switch. In this game, you basically click a ball that's a certain color and then you have to like get the stars but you only have to touch certain colors and this is really fun so yeah I've been really liking that for when I'm bored so I just switch between the two games so the first empty that I have is this contact solution but yeah it's just a Kirkland brand multi-purpose solution um, it was really cheap it was like nine dollars for three huge um, contact solution bottles and this is 16 ounces so that's a lot of solution um, and I use this every single day to clean my contacts contact lenses um, so yeah 10 out of 10 would recommend another empty product that I've gone through is a toner this is the Clinique clarifying lotion um, it was the pink one I went through this I really didn't like this I didn't feel like it was doing anything for my skin um, um, it didn't make me feel like squeaky clean like I I like to feel like I like to feel squeaky clean in my face before moisturizing and this did not do that for me um, so yeah I wouldn't really recommend this my next empties for the month of March is this Dr. Bronner's Magic Castile Soap and if you've watched my How I Wash My Makeup Brushes video, I use this soap and I love this soap to death. I use this all the time to wash my brushes and I just ran out. Um, I went through this, 10 out of 10 would recommend. I love it. My next and my last empty for the month of March is this purity cleanser that I use every night after I wear makeup. So on days that I don't wear makeup, I wash my face off with Cetaphil, but when I do wear makeup, I wash my face with Purity because it leaves my face feeling a lot cleaner and it takes off all my makeup. So when I wear makeup, I wipe or I wash it off with Purity and I've gone through like three of these already. Alright guys, so that's all for my March favorites and empties. So if you would like to see more videos like this, thumbs up this video down below and don't forget to subscribe and yeah, see y'all next time.